Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gladwell Kozak. If you're new here, please do feel welcome. And if you're one of my returning viewers, thank you very much for stopping by uh, to continue supporting me as we journey through this YouTube journey. Uh, on today's video, I am just going to give you an introduction to my Christmas uh, house decorations for this year. It is almost a mixture of what I did last year and over the years so i do hope guys you're going to enjoy it and please do remember to give me a thumbs up a like and even consider subscribing so that you'll be a member of our online family and yeah as we continue this journey so guys i will not keep you i will just show you what i have done this year uh, so guys this is how my christmas decoration for this year has turned out uh, this is the corridor uh, going down stairs to the living room and kitchen. I will not be filming anything uh, in the um, upper rooms. I'm just showing you uh, the corridor and the downstairs decorations. So this is what we had last year. So I haven't really massively done any big changes. The only thing that I did is I did change the framings on uh, these uh, pictures that I bought back at from home and uh, yeah so it looks just a little bit different but uh, the corridor looks almost exactly as it was looking last year and I still love it that is my um, daughter's stocking and uh, we usually fill up the stocking uh, with the goodies uh the on the 24th so a day before christmas so on christmas eve so that's how the uh railing in the corridor looks like and i absolutely love it and coming down here we have that mat which i bought last year and it says keep calm it's christmas and we do have a live uh wreath which we've hanged outside and uh, i love it as well so coming into the living room uh as you can see i do have this uh angel hanging uh and it does have noel written on it um is the christmas for french for christmas and i absolutely absolutely love it we've had it for years so uh it is nothing new most of the things that i have this year i have had them over the years so we have the uh, lights which we have three of the same and then we, d we do have that reindeer uh, with the lighting and especially it looks far much better when it's actually night because it's glowing it is beautiful and then we also have this uh, tree which we uh, put some the lightings on and we also have put some Christmas um, bubbles and as you can see yeah so that is how the window looks like outside we do have some uh, lights hanged uh, on the wall so at night we have something to um, make the house look brighter I managed uh, to change my uh, cushions. I'd been meaning to do that for a long, long time. And I did manage to do this, uh, I think, uh, last week or two weeks ago. And instead of keeping it, uh, just buying them for Christmas, I just decided to change it because these ones I will be using uh, throughout the year. This, um, I bought them from Next, if you're interested. So this uh, yellow ones, two of them, one each cost seven pounds. And this one, I think it also did cost uh, seven pounds. I don't know if it was a reduction or something like this. This other one here, uh, which is has a velvety material, same as this one. I also did buy it, I think at uh, 14 pounds. So uh, it is given because I did not want to completely change the look around my house. I did still have uh, yellow um, 
cushions before but i just wanted a kind of a different feel so you can see it is still almost the same but not quite and i am loving the new look with of the overall sofa so with the uh, christmas decoration on this bed i do have my stars i have to admit that i absolutely love love the star theme in my house when it comes to christmas this um black and white ones i bought from matalan last year and i still do love it and I, and the wooden one as well i did buy it at matalan these other bits that we have here the christmas angel the glow those ones we've had for quite uh, a while this is a live plant which my son decided to uh dress it dress it up a little bit with the, the um little uh bubbles which they absolutely look look lovely and this uh lantern i did buy it uh last year oh this year i think uh somewhere in july in ikea and i have bought a candle and uh, we surely shall be burning it as time goes by and uh with the decorations uh my husband put some christmas lighting uh inside this um flower container so it's giving it a good nice feeling uh for christmas so guys this is that uh end of uh, that corner so coming in near the window near where the sofa is and where all the lighting so come evening when it's dark outside and the house is lit so everything just glows and it's nice and it's beautiful i did uh, buy this uh, flower vase i bought it from ikea uh, and it is i think it's one of the cheapest buy that I, I bought but really really pretty um flower uh, vase i think i bought it if i'm i can't remember well it was a one pound uh, 49p that's how cheap it was and look how really really pretty it looks like uh with those roses on them uh on this side of the sofa uh these are also new pillows uh cushions these ones i also did buy from uh next and uh for each pillow it cost me uh 22 pounds but i am so i am absolutely loving it so i bought the same pillows the same time as i bought these ones on this other side uh but the um ho 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 uh pillow one i bought it maybe three or four christmases uh back uh i can't remember exactly where i bought it but i think it is in matterland so when we come to this end uh is where we have our christmas themed um house so we have the house we have the church and we do have the uh, shopping center or the toy center and it is lit up and it is beautiful and then we have the uh, flower jar again my husband uh, put in some cones some uh, lighting so just to give it that christmas uh feel and it is absolutely beautiful so guys this is my christmas tree it is the same one that i had last year the same decorations i have just added a little bit of extra but this is exactly how my christmas uh, tree looked uh last year uh the letters are that is for my son uh batosh and for my daughter renata uh, for myself uh, down here and for my husband and i telling you guys i love love our christmas uh, themed tree i just wanted it not to be red black and white um, i just wanted to have that gold white shiny feeling to it so that's why i did not want uh, the traditional uh, looking tree uh, and these ones, I absolutely love them. I bought them from our local supermarket and I think they are absolutely, absolutely brilliant. It's only that I just bought one. I was meant, it was meant for my son's uh, Christmas uh, tree up in his room, but 
they were a little bit too heavy for his tree so he decided to give us and I don't mind having them and uh, yeah so that is a part of the pack that we bought and I absolutely absolutely love love those little things and all, all over the years some of the things that we have here uh, the bubbles are things that we've had for over the years so we interchanged we changed the theme and all that kind of stuff but some of them they stay with us for as many many years as we have been so that is a tree and that is the angel and i am just loving that tree and the corner where the tree is and uh yeah that's how our living room uh looks like at the moment uh, on this end we have uh the table and i did buy this candle uh scented candle it's a uh, smoked uh tonak and tea and these are not scented candles uh i bought these stands uh not long ago from matterland and i just love the look of the dining table and especially this year it'll be different because i finally made it uh to get a uh, light over the, the our table so i uh, will be having a different kind of fill this christmas with a meal instead of using the normal uh big light to uh reflect the whole room it's just the light that we need for over the table while we are eating our christmas meal and not only our christmas meal but basically all the meals uh over uh the 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 year anyway so basically that's how my living room looks like that's how christmas uh our decorations have come about and i am absolutely absolutely enjoying this moment while we wait for christmas uh to come about um on this end obviously i have my cat who is rested his uh little um uh, place has been moved because it's usually where the Christmas uh, tree is and uh, yeah he is not complaining much so this is my kitchen um, on this side I do have this uh, flowers that I bought they are actually real uh, flowers which are decorated uh, in gold and I am absolutely loving it and these are the other knickknacks that we've ever we've had over the years this uh, showing it's going it's it's beginning to look a lot like christmas and then this uh flower that we bought from our local supermarket it will bloom is ama uh, ama realis ama realis and it will bloom into this kind of flower uh before the, the before the start of christmas so fingers crossed because when we bought it it was quite short now it's actually grown uh in the last two weeks uh, these other decorations here, hangings, are things that we've had over the years. So I am also uh, just loving how they look like. Uh, the wreath here, outside here in the corridor, we've had that for, for years. So it is something that we continually use because at the end of the day, you just keep on using what you've had and accumulated over the years, really. Uh, on this end, I have my Noel uh, message and I have the Christmas uh, uh, bell that uh, we bought. It's, it's been with us for maybe over 10 years. And I have my baking baits and all that kind of stuff. I have the reindeer. And on here, I have my uh, containers because soon we will start doing the baking, um, baking cookies and all such kind of stuff. And I also do have uh, the container, which is having all the nice smells of Christmas and uh, yeah, coming through and uh, just getting excited, knowing that it is time to share for family, for all of us to be together and just loving each and every moment as we go. So guys, that's how my lovely, lovely, uh, Christmas decorations have panned out this year and uh, I do hope yeah, before uh, long I will also be sharing with you uh, as we bake, as we make choices on 
things that we will be doing this year and uh yeah as we go along i will be sharing them with you and uh yeah um uh, i do hope you enjoyed this video and i do hope that you like it you leave a comment and then uh even consider subscribing and uh being part of our family our youtube family and uh yeah keep this channel going and growing with us and uh yeah leaving all the best uh comments and uh things that you may like things questions that you may have and uh yeah let's keep this journey going and guys i do appreciate you coming by each and every time and uh i do hope to see you uh soon so guys without keeping you uh i will say thank you very much for stopping by and i do hope to see you in the next one so bye for now Thank you.